Boom! What's up? It's Jeremy. Welcome to my channel. I'm going to do a review today for you on a blood pressure monitor. As you can see in the title, this one is called the Kazan Upper Arm Intelligent Type Blood Pressure Monitor. It's interesting. It says intelligent type on there. I wonder if there's a dumb blood pressure monitor out there or an unintelligent blood pressure monitor, but it does say intelligent type on there. I thought that was interesting. So I'm going to do this review here. I had one of these before. If you scroll down, in my videos there's one of a blood pressure monitor i forget the exact brand but i did a, a review on one several months back that one was my fault I, I broke the screen on it accidentally i think i dropped it or something and uh so i scrolled around to amazon and i saw one in, the, in around the same price range i think this was around 30 bucks or something like that so not too pricey um the important thing about blood pressure as you probably know already is it's it's a, an indicator of health um, and it's an indicator of, of the pressure in your arteries, which affect your heart, your kidneys, your circulation, and so many things in your body. And they call it the silent killer because a lot of times there's no symptoms of high blood pressure. Sometimes people have symptoms like headaches and, and things like that. Sometimes it gets to the point of where you have issues like heart attack, stroke, and, and all those sort of issues. So um, it's good to be preventative and keep track of, of things like, like blood pressure. So we're gonna get into this one right here right now it's a kazan upper arm intelligent type blood pressure monitor ordered through amazon i have not opened this box yet so it's the first time for both of us so let's see here so right on the front it has it lists everything that's in the box um, it tells you it checks for arrhythmias it checks for uh, average function it's high accuracy that's good double users measurement records so that means you can have two users on this thing and as an l l c d display on on the uh, on the monitor which is good so you don't have to guess what the numbers are they're, they're putting the numbers right on the front for you on this so that's a good thing got a picture of it right there what that looks like um it has specifications on the back which is pretty cool it tells you the blood pressure is zero to 280 so it tells you how high it goes hopefully no one has a blood pressure of 280 uh on any of one of the numbers and it tells you the pulse is 40 to 199 beats per minute so it's giving you the range that they use on this on this uh, blood pressure monitor uh, rhythmia checking it tells you, you can put, has the time and the date it tells you what the power source is so this power source is internal dc triple a batteries and it's also external dc uh, five volts one a whatever that means so let's get into this let's unbox this let's open this up and see what we have here so i'm gonna pull the top open here it wasn't taped shut so pull the top open Okay, so we're right here. We have the cord, one cord that came out. This is the type of cord that plugs into a uh, like a USB type cord. And then we have it has the actual cup itself. And I don't know if this is a, a small or a large. I like to use large cuffs. When I use a small cuff, I usually get a higher reading because my arms are um, a little bit over 18 inches. Not bragging. And then we have. The actual monitor itself, which is here, and that's what it looks like right there. So that's the monitor there. And then, what else is in the box? They gave me a scratch and win card of some kind here. And it tells you I can win a gift card, 90% discount, and a free trial on a new product. So I got a gift card in here, some, some kind of scratch and win thing. So put that over there. And then there is the manual and who are we kidding I'm not reading that so we're gonna put that right here so that's the manual and uh, I'm not suggesting that you don't read the manual but you know how it is I don't read them I just kind of just go along with the flow here so I'm gonna open this up and okay pull this open and actually I don't read it because I I've used one of these before and I've, I've my last blood pressure monitor it worked it looked exactly like this one so um but i do recommend you read the manual so you know what you're doing and let's see here and i'm gonna need a block to plug this in because i don't have a block um it didn't come with a block so this here as you know this this is the thing that plugs in uh, to one of those blocks and this did not come with the plug that this plugs into um, I, don't, I don't know if I'll call that a negative or a strike against them um, but it, it's interesting that they didn't come with the box but I think typically they figure everybody has 
these blocks. So um, I'm going to uh, run and grab my block right now. Hold on. All right, like magic. I'm back. I got this block right here. Um, so this is what I was talking about. I don't know if this is called a block or not, but this is what this plugs into. So just so you know, you're either going to use double A, triple A batteries with this, or you're going to use one of these blocks. And these are simple. It just plugs into here. And I think everybody on the planet knows how these work by now, just because of uh, the way technology is now. So that plugs in there. And we're going to plug this into this cord. Hopefully this comes on. All right, I got power. All right. And so the display comes up here. It's nothing quite on there yet. All right, so we're going to um, open this guy up here. This is the cuff. And I, like I said before, this looks like a, a smaller cuff. I think the cuff I had before was a little bit bigger than this. Um, I like an extra large cuff because if you have a small cuff, the studies say that the reading um, can be sometimes a little bit off and it could be higher than than it should be so we're gonna go ahead and put this bad boy on so how this works is you just open this up like that the velcro facing out and it has a, an indicator on here of where to put your arm there's an arrow right here on where to place where the arrow goes for your shoulder so it tells you to line it up with your shoulder so I'm gonna put this on my left arm and throw this in here. Move this all the way up. And then you just pull it tight like that. And then the arrow is pointing up to the shoulder right there. So it's pretty easy. Anyone can probably figure out how to put this on because the arrow goes right up to your shoulder. Easy enough to use. Um, palm's supposed to be up like this. And from what I know with this, is your arm should be heart level. This is a little bit below, I think, but we're gonna roll with it this way for now. So I'm gonna hit the start button here. Okay, and there we go. So I don't know if you can hear that or not, but it sounds like an air compressor. Okay, so it's 124 over 85 is the reading that I have there. And the pulse it says is 93. So. Um, that's probably about about right for me um, and it has memory on here so you can lock that into the memory and I hope I hit the set button again and I'll see if I can give you an idea what the screen looks like there I'll hit start again and then and it's gonna start in a minute here start well, anyway that's what the screen looks like there right in the front and there it goes it's it's going again so that's what it looks like as it's doing the reading so that's it there um this seems to work fine um it came the box came in the box the box opened up really easy there was no issues uh ordering off of amazon the quality seems uh seems really high um the cuff seems like a high quality cuff and uh you will see um how this this plays out over time how this how this works um, if you have any questions or anything, shoot me a message in the comments and let me know um, uh, if you have one of these and how, how they work for you or what brand you like to use. Hope this has been informative. Quick review today on the blood pressure monitor. Again, this is Kazon, Intelligent Type Blood Pressure Monitor, ordered off of Amazon. I think it was around $30 or so. Boom!